What's up, nerdlings? What up, nerdlings? Guess what? Do you nerd for more mail and mail? Mail and mail. What's up, guys? This is Jay from the Game Chasers, and you are watching Do You Nerd? Yes, we got another package. First and foremost, guys, seriously, you are spoiling us. You don't have to send us anything. Nobody ever has to send us anything. We greatly appreciate it, but you really never have to send us anything. <laughs> this one is very special. This is from our Tom from Another Mom, our Brit Git with the Sega Wit, our <laughs> Retro Refresh Brother Sega Head. <laughs> Now, uh, Sega Head. First of all, wow. Hopefully, everything made it because, uh, yeah, it's, Holy. it's a little, uh, busting open. And Holy ripped cardboard, Batman! Huh? You're grown! It's all metal! It's full of holes, you know? Holy! Oh. It's great because you know it's from Sega Head due to the fact that on the top it is labeled Sega. Sega! I also like this. Obviously, since it was coming to America, we have Captain America on there. That's America's ass. I'm gonna take that later. All right, well, let's get into this thing. Yeah. There's a note. Oh, nice. We always love our handwritten notes. And it uh, looks like we each get a, a letter this time. Dear Tom, first of all, please excuse the bad handwriting. I know it looks like I have arthritis. It's a shitty hand syndrome. Also, sorry for the bad spelling. Hey, you don't have to apologize for anything. This guy is constantly having his handwriting compared to Elvish. You have been a great friend throughout these tough times, and yet you don't even really know me. I just want to say thank you for the support and send you guys some prezzies. Included is a PAL-only SNES game, Ooh. and what I believe is Europe-only candy. Yes. No, I don't know if I'll be a YouTuber again, but never say never. If I have anything to say about it, you'll be back. Just just had to had to twist that knife, didn't you? <laughs> I'm feeling woozy air. Yeah. <clears throat> Dear Lacey, you have an awesome collection and you own the one thing that people can spend an entire lifetime searching for. A good man. Oh. Wow. Jeez. Jeez, man. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> I, I concur. Take good care of Tom, as he will only increase in value. <laughs> Joke's on you. You have any idea how many times she's taken me out of my packaging? P.S. I have no idea if the chocolate is to your liking, but if you ever want a game from the PAL region, just let me know. Sick it! Nice. Very nice. nice. Very nice. Well, looks like we've got some fun stuff in here. So, first of all... Here's that pal game he was nice. talking about. So Jelly Boy. Is, is, is his stomach punching things? <laughs> Who needs Chuck <laughs> Norris punching you with his beard? Chuck Norris. When you've got a fist coming out of your belly. I think he's trying to say something about fat Americans there. Yeah. Uh, maybe, maybe. <laughs> blubber, 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 oh, blubber, blubber, oh. Maybe, <laughs> maybe he was testing a if that'd be a good nickname for me, it was Jelly Boy. <laughs> uh, well, first of all, somebody put a label on top. Thank you for nice. that, whoever did that. Because, yeah, the PAL and Japanese ones did not have that in label, which is why I use some video game dust sleeves for that issue. Uh, of course, in America, the N64 ended up doing the same thing. But, anyway, I know nothing about Jelly Boy. I'm looking forward to seeing this one. I do know that back in the day, Ocean used to put out some pretty good games, though. So I'm very much looking forward to this. I always love to check out some of the games that we never got and yeah. see what we missed out on. Yeah, so if this be is fun. a PAL exclusive, this is gonna be a lot of fun.
<laughs> so thank you very much. You know I always like getting some games. And of course, you know it's Nintendo, so he had to get it out of his collection. Just get out! Just get out! So it is looking like we've got treats. Treats? Um, I think you're going to approve Oreo. of this one. Oreo! So Cadbury Dairy mm, Milk Cadbury Oreo. Cadbury is good. It is very good chocolate. Now over here, I have seen some of the Dairy Milk bars. I wonder if that's like their version of milk chocolate. That makes sense. Or their sense. way of saying milk chocolate. Makes sense. And it's very smooth and creamy. But I've never seen the Oreo one. And you are an Oreo I fanatic. I love Oreos. Oreos are my favorite. Well, shall we? We shall. Ooh, look, there's instructions on how to open it. So you've got that really nice, big, thick bar going on there. And segmented so you can try mm. little bits and pieces. Smell that. That is very good. It's All wonderful. Right. Look at the uh, Oreo filling nice. in there. Mm. Oh, yeah. That is really smooth and creamy. But then you've got the crunchy of the cookie, and then that smooth yet not so smooth Oreo filling. Yeah, the, the Oreo cream adds a different texture. Mm -hmm. Like it's a little more pronounced mm. over the creamy dairy oh, milk good. chocolate, I guess. Oh, man. You guys, if you've ever had uh, like Cadbury's eggs at Easter time, you know, just that Cadbury mm -hmm. chocolate is always so good. And the Oreo really lends itself well it to that. It does. It really does. It gives that crunch to that really smooth creaminess. That's good stuff. All right. Well, next, looks like we're going for the gold. <laughs> so, McVitie's gold. Now, it says crunchy biscuit bars with a unique gold coating. Hmm. So, it's coated in gold. I love gold. Gold. So individually wrapped, yeah. which is nice. Wrapped candies. I opened mine already. It, it kind of looks like a Kit Kat. Like it reminds yeah. me of like a Kit Kat. Looks like a Kit Kat on the inside. Mm-hmm. That's good. So it's got that good cookie base, mm. and then that. Uh, so it's, it's a really caramel. Crunchy cookie. It's a caramel coating, but it's almost like a salted caramel. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And that's kind of what I'm getting from it. It's good. It's a, I like one of the, it's really crunchy in there. Mm, yeah, that is really good. Oh, we've got a bigger item. Cadbury chocolate spread. Oh my gosh. So already it's kind of like the Nutella spread uh -huh. or the Reese's spread. And now see here they call it milk chocolate. So I don't know. I guess Sega Head, you'll have to let us know what... What's what? Mmm. We're gonna need something to try this out. I know it'd be perfect for that. <laughs> Animal crackers. Oh, my elephant had a little accident. That's gross. Can you imagine this on an English muffin? Oh my gosh. That is amazing. Hey, you're double dipping. My house. <laughs> oh, that is so good. Um, but that's bad. Because you do realize I'm a large man as is. And this is not going to help. In fact, this is only going to exacerbate that. What do you mean? Well, you guys hardly get on, do you? Now, what does exacerbate me? Mm, oh, man. I think I'm getting the diabetes. <laughs> oh, more! Well, <laughs> seriously! Put that diabetes on hold because we've got oh. more Cadbury, Bourneville, and apparently this is just for me because uh, dark chocolate. Hey, I enjoy a good dark chocolate with a good glass of red wine. Voila! <laughs> nice. Wow. So nice segmented pieces, but these are big. That almost looks like baking cocoa. Thick pieces. I'm gonna smell that. Wow, man. That smells like baking cocoa. Oh. 
Oh, felt like you broke a knuckle. So I love my dark chocolate, although I will say, you're right, that does smell like baking cocoa. And I once made the mistake as a little kid. <laughs> I saw the baking cocoa in the cabinet, and I got a big spoonful and never again. That's really good actually though. A lot of times when I get our dark chocolate over here, it's too bitter for me. This isn't bitter at all. It's just good like, like a rich chocolate, like a deep rich. Yeah, you are right. It's really weird because it smells like that, that dark chocolate that we're used to. Mm-hmm. And I could eat this. There's no bitterness to it at all. It's really kind of weird because it still tastes like dark chocolate, but it doesn't necessarily have that bite. Cheers. Get gaming off the grid here with their cigars. We'd have a whole different kind of party going on. Wow, yeah, we would. I'm really impressed. Maybe uh, if we were across the pond, I wouldn't mind dark chocolate so much. I guess not. <laughs> well, there is still more. More? But I think you're safe from diabetes. Okay, good. Hi, I'm Wilford Brimley, and I have diabetes. It hurts me to pee, and it causes me to be short with my family. And two weeks ago, I ran out of vanilla ice cream and struck my wife. And then I find out my wife's been dead for six years. Who the hell did I hit? We have... Ooh, the doctor is in. Bender Snake Cucumber Patch. <laughs> this is a oh, great man. figure yes, of Doctor Strange. I love Doctor Strange. I am so ready for the next movie. I did not get enough of, of uh, Doctor Strange. You know, we didn't get enough of him in Infinity War. No. Period. He was so underutilized. He Listen, was. you don't take the master of mysticism no. and have him hold up some water during yeah. the big battle. Uh, no. Yeah. No. Oh. And I don't really feel like we got a lot of him in the first movie because it was an origin story. So we spent half the movie of him getting to how cool he could be. So he's standing on a base that's got the emblem for the Sanctum Centaurum. Yeah. And this is a great action pose, too. Oh, yeah. I love the cape. flaring. You know, he's got his magical shield up and everything. <laughs> so that nice. is very cool. And the next one... Might have had a, a little bit of a shipping accident, but pretty sure uh, we can get her right as rain again. Oh yeah, a little bit of glue will fix that. Yeah, actually uh, she came off the peg and it looked like it was just her foot trying to hold her in place. So that part broke, but that's no big deal at all. And uh, you know, I believe that is Katarina. From League of Legends? Yeah. Although the knives that she has uh, kind of reminds me of a pickup you got recently. Yeah, she still hasn't put those away, guys, because she's uh, been chasing no, me with them. No, I carry these with me everywhere. Well, she kind of does. And actually, if that's the case, the red those hair. knives, the red hair. So I guess this is you. That's got to be me. Which means uh, I'm Doctor Strange. I'm okay with that. I, I'm cool with that, too. I'm totally cool with this. Yeah, I could rock that look. Oh, yeah. Get, get the haircut, get some, uh, some gray there. I could do that. I look good with a coat and a cape, yeah. goodness all right i think we finally reached the end okay. of it and actually this was packed really well there's a lot of packing material there's even some styrofoam and stuff yeah um i'm pretty sure this was probably fine all the way over here and ace ventura probably took it that last mile which yeah. is uh why it was a little beat up on the box not but, to mention you know trying to come across the pond but everything else was yeah. fine inside. I mean, just a little, you know, issue that we can fix. But this is too nice, yeah, man. Yeah, dude. Thank you. Way too nice. Uh, first of all, I mean, you know, giving us candy and treats. 
you know, you, you've got us there. But then <laughs> toys, because, you know, the lady loves toys. I do love my toys. Game, because, you know, the guy loves his games. And just the fact that it's coming from you, Sega Head. And, uh, you know, we're just going to, you know, keep mentioning Sega Head. You know what, nerdlings? You need to go over to Sega Head's channel. I'm going to leave a link down in the description. <laughs> And you need to start commenting on all of his videos. First of all, watch him because the man is hilarious. Yes. I mean, yeah, he has me in stitches all the oh, time. Yeah. His skits, his persona, his energy, his his video skills are top notch oh, yeah. too. You need to watch all those videos and leave comments on every single one asking him when his next video is and telling him to come back to YouTube because we miss him. Yes. But you guys should miss him too. Yes. We need shirts. We need merchandise. We need Sega merchandise. We do. We do. We, we, need, we need some, some Sega, Sega head, head merch. But seriously, Tom, thank you so Don't much. Call him Tom, that's a nice name. <laughs> thank you so much for sending us all this yeah, stuff. This we is definitely amazing. didn't have to. Uh, you know, I mean, we love checking out new candy anyway. We have a local restaurant called London Calling. Mm, yes. And they serve pasties. Yes. That's their main thing. He is thing. a transplant. He is an expat. Yes. And they usually have uh, some candies for sale that you can try mm -hmm. that are from, you know, the UK. Although I've never seen any of these here before. No, he's had some Cadbury, but not this But stuff. yeah, not the Oreo mm -hmm. one. And I mean, so this was great I mean, because we love trying new stuff. Yes. So, all right. Well, Nerdlings, please give the video a like if you yes. happen to like it. And leave some comments down below what you think of any of this. Let us know how Sega Head did with his... Uh, candy selection did he pick the right stuff and let us know if this is totally us right here or what do you know about jelly boy because we're gonna have to check that out make sure that you subscribe hit that notification bell and make sure you go and subscribe to sega head hit that notification bell because never say never if he comes back you want to be alerted oh yeah once he starts posting videos again because he's gonna start posting videos again aren't you sega head you need to listen to the mom and dad of YouTube. Button bashers, help us out. <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget to like us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Go over to Tee Public because we have merchandise over there and soon Sega Head will too. And go hit us up on the Retro Refresh. Don't forget, guys, if we like it. We nerd it for candy, candy. and games and action figures. Mini me's. Mini me's, mini us, <laughs> mini eyes, mini we. Bye, nerdlings. Bye. No more. I can't take it anymore. Please. Huh? You brought my glasses. Bless your little heart. That's not right. That's oh! Ready for a full video take two? And the thing is, this one is from across the pond. It is from our fellow... Oh, we got a bigger device. Oh. Device. Device. <laughs> ready? Can you call a friend on it? Are you ready? Yes. Uh, I want some more chocolate. <laughs> Or if you want to see a, see a, hang on. <laughs> or if you want to see a lot of videos about Sega. Retro Refresh.